How's up everybody, Roderick here with the Burzala Cordless Water Flosser. Now if you want to take your oral hygiene to the next level, what you need are two things. One, you need a good electric toothbrush, and two, you apparently need a good water flosser. I've always wanted one of these, although when I thought about getting it, I was like, I never even floss. The only time I floss is when I go to the dentist and he's like, when's the last time you flossed? I'm like, right before I came here. What up? This features a 360 degree nose rotator so you can get it to the perfect angle to get all the crevices in your mouth, a two minute timer so you can make sure you get the full benefits of cleaning. It's IPX7 waterproof, obviously. It has a rechargeable battery that will let you use it one to two times a day for up to two weeks with just a four hour charge. It has a 200 milliliter capacity for water. It has three modes, normal, soft, and pulse. And the water pressure is between 30 and 100 PSI. Well, which one is it? Nice looking packaging with a great design really gets the point across. We have wireless convenience, a battery display, and pulsed water flow. Over on the right side, we have some features and specs. On the back, it shows we can get rid of food residue, gingivitis bleeding, and braces, which are hard to clean. And on the left side, we have some more features. Packaged nicely. Inside the box, we have some tips, a thank you card, a user manual, a nice drawstring travel bag, a power adapter, and a proprietary USB cable, and a pack of color-coded tips so you can share this with your family. All right, nice looking tip with that colored ring. And then that's where all the magic happens. The water squirts out through that little hole. And then onto the flosser. On the bottom, we have the 200 milliliter water tank, the power button, the mode button, which mode it's in, the battery indicator, and the charging port, which has a nice rubber stopper to keep the water out. Up top, we have the lock button, which keeps the flossing tips in place. Installing the tip is really simple. All you have to do, that's it. Now it's in there. Awesome, right? And then it turns 360 degrees. If you want to take it out, you hold this button and gently take it out. Simple. Opening up the water tank is as simple as turning it to the unlock position and pulling out. You can also just open this flap. Why are there two options? I'm not sure. But this does look nice and it feels super high quality with this nice grip. I'm loving it. Oh, it looks like we have a full battery. So now if you excuse me, I'm gonna go floss for the first time in six months. But first, I need some water. Yeah, 200 milliliters. Easy. All right, now I'm in the bathroom. I'm about to put this to the test. As you can see, I do have something right here on my teeth. Let's see if we can actually get rid of it with the water flosser. I'm not sure what to expect here, so let's turn this thing on. Is it just gonna shoot out? Whoa, do you see that? <laughs> that thing is powerful. That was a really fine line of water. Okay, let's see if we can do this now. That thing's pretty powerful. It was stabbing my tongue. Okay, it looks like you can change the mode while it's off. That way you're not surprised when it starts pulsing in your mouth. So I have it on normal now. I feel like it's gonna hurt even more. Fingers crossed. That's pretty cool, look at that. That piece of stuff that was in my teeth is gone. There's a two minute timer on this thing. I'm not sure how you can use it for two minutes since your mouth gets full of water, but if you can do that, well, you win, I guess. You have to swallow? Mm, my tongue kind of hurts. Is that normal? I feel like it's gonna start bleeding. <laughs> well, we ran out of water. I'm not sure if that lasted two minutes or not, but Two minute timer, I'm not sure what the point of that is. There's no way you're gonna last the whole two minutes anyways because your mouth will be full of water. Well, my teeth do feel clean. Mm. Although my tongue is a little bit irritated. Woo, that was crazy, you guys. My tongue is hurting because that powerful jet action was really pushing against it. It was like a knife going against my tongue. Now, as for using it for two whole minutes, that's gotta be impossible because after about 30 seconds, my mouth was full of water and there's no way I can continue on. But it did a good job getting through my teeth, cleaning out the crevices, and my mouth feels really clean. Yeah. So overall, really impressed, definitely never using an actual piece of floss ever again. I mean, why bother when you have a water flosser? It is the future and there's no wires. Look, see? So if you wanna pick one of these up, I'll throw the link down below in the description. Make sure you guys comment your thoughts down below. Let me know if you guys are using one of these powerful water flossers or if you're gonna pick one up. I'm dying to know what you guys think of it compared to a regular flosser and your dentist will thank you for making his job so much easier. You know what? Maybe you shouldn't use it. Make them work for all that money they're charging, am I right? Thumbs up, red subscribe button, social media, and I'll see you in the next one.